Colin, wake up. I'm not sure when you'll hear this. Wake up. I'm not sure what time or what day my message will get through. Wake up. But you need to wake up, son. Colin, wake up. There's been an accident. You've been in a coma for 385 days. Wake up. Please, son, wake up. We miss you. Some kid named Colin is shitting his pants right now. Guys, one of these sites is a scam and one of them is legit. Stick around for a minute and I'll tell you which is which. Recently, I have been doing a lot of work with the site CS Money. It is a trading site. A lot of you guys have been leaving me comments like, why are you speaking out against gambling and then promoting gambling in your intros? Uh, if you guys actually went to the site, you'd see that it's it's not a gambling site at all. It's a trading site. And also, I have no issue with gambling. Um, <laughs> what the heck? But basically, I all of the work that I've been doing with CS Money has just been like intros and stuff. I really haven't done much promotional stuff for them other than those intros. And I would like to say my intro deal with them is actually done now. I don't know if they're going to renew it or not. Not, to be honest so this video is not sponsored I wasn't like told to do this or anything this is just something that somebody came to me with in a YouTube comment uh, I will have the comment on the screen and I have seen a lot of these comments a lot to the point where I, I thought it was appropriate to make a video on it uh, but this is CS money I'm gonna go over it really quick just in case you guys don't know what it is if you're just stumbling in because I'm in your recommended thanks YouTube uh, we're gonna go over it so CS money is a trade site for CSGO there are a lot of different trade sites that use bots like this basically what you do is you take skins that you have you can take you know five or six skins that you have in your inventory let's say it equals 17 dollars right from here you can either trade to their bots and take out a 17 dollar skin or you can take out something cheaper in this case let's say i want to take out all these junk skins for a dollar 23 and it would add 16 dollars to my balance up here in the right now if you click trade it'll send you a trade offer on steam if we actually go into my trade offers here uh, you'll be able to see that i do actually have it it's a one-to-one -one trade cs money is going to be trading me their items for my items i can respond to the offer accept it confirm it on mobile and everything is fantastic Everything's fantastic and I have my skins, right? But it's come to my attention that there's a fake version of CS Money and the site looks almost identical to the real one. As you can see, if we scroll down to the actual trade section of the fake site, the items are actually different. The first skin is an Eye by Power Hollow on the fake site and the first skin on the real site is a Titan Hollow and so on. I mean, this one has a Fire Serpent on the top row. This one does not. Now, basically, the way that I think they're doing this is they have kind of a save state of whatever skins were in the inventory at the time. And I'm sure this updates every day or two. Uh, to whatever new skins they have in their inventory but it just stays with that because none of these skins are actually real if you actually want to make a trade for one of these it would not work and i'll explain why another small discrepancy in the two sites that i notice is if i click back and forth you can see that the text sizes are a little bit different and a little bit off this is something that if you don't know what you're looking for you're not going to know the difference between because it's such a small detail if you're somebody stumbling onto this trade site for the first time uh, you're not going to know the difference between the regular real text size and the fake text size so you're just you know you're going to be none the wiser but it's something that I noticed from using the real site for the past like year and a half. The biggest way to tell that this site is not authentic is by the URL itself. As you can see, they're both HTTPS. They're both secured servers. However, if I switch back and forth between the real and the fake one, you can see a little dot appear under the S and the, the one with the dot under the S is actually the fake site. I don't know how this exactly works. I'm not really into coding or anything. The S is basically like a symbol for like some compressed text. And, uh, you know, the regular CS money is just CS money. I'm too poor to afford Microsoft Word, but if I open this up in a nice WordPad document and I paste in the fake site, you can see that it's completely different from if I copy and paste in the real site. So let me full screen this for a second and I'll make them a little bit bigger for you. As you can see, oh, that's too big. As you can see, the real CS money, if you copy and paste it, it just appears as CS.money, whereas the fake one appears as XN-C-IRM.money. And basically all of this text here, the X through M right here is compressed under this little s with the dot under it now i don't know how this works i don't know what it means but that's basically what it is and it looks pretty much exactly like the real cs money i mean the dot is so small that i would literally just think it was a piece of dust on my monitor and try and wipe it off and i wouldn't pay any attention to it also how often do you really analyze the url of a website i mean seriously this is a really good scam it's a very scary scam too because i'm sure it's it's gotten a lot of people i myself have seen probably 15 or 20 comments about it in the past couple of weeks of me doing these CS Money intros. So it's important to know the difference between the sites. I think that the best way that I can give you guys, if you're not sure about a site or if it's the first couple times you're using the site, is to go onto the site's Twitter account. As you can see, this is CSGO Empire. This is just a random site that I thought of. Uh, you can tell that it's the real Twitter, even if they're not verified, by the amount of followers they have and the amount of people that follow them. Now, if you're really active on Twitter and you follow YouTubers, you'll have this little followers you know thing. So you'll be able to see what YouTubers actually follow these accounts. And obviously, if somebody like Mick 
Skillet or somebody like Watch Games is following, you know, one of these gambling sites, it's obviously going to be the real version of the site. As for trading sites, uh, CS Money, I know I follow on Twitter. I follow a lot of them. So if you guys want to follow me on Twitter, this isn't really a shameless plug. This is just kind of trying to help you out. You don't have to, but um, I do follow most of the real trading sites. So if you guys, you know, okay, I'm not going to put that in. That's that's too shameless of a plug. <laughs> link in the description though. But seriously, if you go onto the Twitter accounts of any of these sites that you're trying to use, they'll always have a link in their like uh, about section of their profile. You can just click that and this will 100% bring you to the real website. As you can see, this is obviously the real CSGO empire. That's not what we're talking about though. So I'm going to move on. Another site that just showed up that you guys might want to check out is Scam Alert. And I will have this linked in the description below as well. I think Tay Butter and Juicy are in on this site together. Uh, and basically what it is, it's the database of all of the different sites that they come across and um, they have warnings or sponsored or safe on them. And it'll, it'll basically let you guys know what sites are actually scams and what sites are not. Now, I've never personally used the site. I don't know what's actually going on with it. However, they do have sections for gambling, trading codes, and methods. After I record this, I am going to actually see if I can get them to add this fake CS money site into their database because it, it is a scam and I, I do want people to stay aware. You know, even if I'm not partnered or working with this site, I do think it's important that people know it exists. It's a good site from what I see uh, to, to check if a site is legitimate or not. So instead of, you know, asking some sketchy dude on the internet like myself, if a site is real or if you should bet your skins on it, just head over to this site and look and see if it's on here. If it's not on here, then I, I don't know what to tell you. Just, I guess, ask a sketchy dude like me. Anyways, all in all, I'm going to log into the fake site and there is a couple other things that it tells you. Uh, as you can see, when you go to sign in to the fake version of the site, it gives you a phishing, scamming, and spamming warning from Steam because the site has been flagged as a scam. If you ever see this on a site, it's most likely a scam and you shouldn't continue, but I'm going to continue anyway just for the sake of the video and we are going to see what we got going on here. So the site itself looks exactly the same. I have used it. So the site itself looks exactly the same as the real one. I have actually put my trade link in already. This is the second time I'm recording this video. I wanted to condense it. So, so one of the biggest things that I noticed is a lot of these scam sites, they'll try and get at least like 10 or 20 bucks from you. And this is exactly what this site is doing. As you can see, they got a $10 skin in here. That's their cheapest skin that they have in their bot, as opposed to the real CS money that has, you know, seven to 10 cent skins as their cheapest skins at all times. Now I'm going to make a trade on the site. I'm not actually going to accept the trade, but I do want to show you guys what happens when you do make the trade. So I'm going to throw in this skin. It says it's a $25 skin. I don't really think it is, but we're going to throw it in there anyways. And then we're going to grab this $10 CZ75 skin. Uh, as you can see, CS Money has a balance system implemented where it'll add it to my balance. I think I already mentioned that. But if I'm, you know, trading this $25 skin for a $10 skin, what it should do is give me the $10 skin and put $16 or $15.90 in my balance. If I go to hit trade, what it's going to do is is it's going to give me a little warning. It's, it's going to say, We have new algorithm on our site. Now you have to fill your balance via your skins. And after that, you will get selected skins from bot. I made it Russian because that's how I think scammers sound. I like Russia. So basically what they're saying is I have to deposit my skin without getting anything back first. So the point of this bot being here is that I can select the skins I want and just make the trade. As you can see, if I go to the real CS money trade, it's just a one-to-one -one trade. My items for their items. The scam site, however, is telling me that I need to deposit my skins completely into this balance system before I can actually withdraw anything. Uh, and this allows them to maximize their profits as well as you losing the most amount of money that you can. Because if you were getting a $10 skin back and trading a $25 skin, they're only going to be losing $25, so they need some way to make it an effective scam. I've seen a lot of people have gotten caught up with this, and uh, they've fallen for it. Now, while I'm waiting for this trade to go through so I can show you guys the difference between the two trades in Steam, I would like to say a couple of the comments that I saw that made me want to make this video were people saying that they Google searched CS Money, uh, and the fake site came up. So if you guys are Google searching anything, make sure, make absolute sure that it's the right site. Anyway, so looking at these trades, I had to send another one on CS Money because mine expired, but this is the fake site on the bottom, and this is the real site on the top. The fake bot says add CS Money balance 2592, and then it gives you a security code. The point of trading sites is to be doing a one-to-one -one trade. Therefore, I would not need a security code, and I wouldn't need to add anything to my balance. If you look at the real CS Money bot, it just says automatically generated from CS Money. And actually, that's kind of weird. They're both bot 13. That's not something I planned. That's just something that happened. But if we actually look 
at the bot. All of their bots are level three, whereas the real CS money bots have been around for a lot longer. They're level 30 and they have like actual text boxes and, and you know, millions of trade made. Another thing that I think is going to be different on here, bot number 13 in Steam would be bot number 13 on the fake site. However, I'm trading from bot 18 on the fake site, so that doesn't make any sense. Whereas as you can see on the real site, I am trading from bot 13. It's the little discrepancies like that that get people because they don't notice the difference. So if I actually go to bot 13 on the fake site, just bear with me for a second. These are all of the skins that they have. If I order this by the highest price, it says that they have a stat track Bowie knife Doppler Sapphire in here in bot 13. If I actually go to this fake trade bot here and I click on it and I look at their inventory, you can see they don't have anything of the sort. They have a bunch of keys. They have a couple like low tier knives and, and that's about it. And the thing with this is these are all items that they've scammed from people. They've scammed both of these knives and all of these keys from somebody and they're yet to clean out their bot because all of the bots, all of the fake bots that they have they may even only have a couple and they may all be named bot 13 i don't even know all of the fake bots don't actually have skins in them other than what they're taking from other people because you're trading your skins to them so another way to really like legit check if your trade is authentic or not is to click on what you're trading with this is a real cs money bot and if i click on the inventory you can see it has like stupid skins in it if i go onto the real cs money and i look this site also has a stat track bowie sapphire in it and if i look in the bot's actual inventory you can see it, it actually does have a stat track Bowie Sapphire in it. It is an authentic trade bot. If the inventories do not match up, decline the trade right away because it is a scam. The point of this video wasn't just to showcase this fake CS money site. Uh, the point of this video was really to just spread awareness about these fake sites in general. They do exist, they are out there, and I'm sure that there is more than one. So be careful when you're out there trading your skins to any kind of website uh, and make sure that you're trading it to the real thing. With that said, guys, I hope you enjoyed. I hope this helped you out. Make sure to check out all the links in the description. Some of them will help you. Some of them are my social medias, and I'd really appreciate if you guys could follow me on those. Uh, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys so much for 70,000 subscribers. We're like there by the time this video goes up. So thank you guys. I appreciate you. Have a great day.